Ainda não tá lá. Pode colocar essa música aqui, ó. Brinks. <risos>
All right, guys. Welcome to the broadcast of MPG Live uh, by Nice TV. So we gotta cast Law League of Legends today for you news over here. So we gotta start the picking bands already. This is gonna be the Neurus, the uh, Colombian team, and Cal Calado de 31. Ecuador, in Ecuador. So here comes the the first buzz we got for the the blue team is Kevin Shaker and the purple team came to Banco Morgana. Uh, two two normals, normal picks, normal bands. So it's gonna be okay. Oh, Shen is the next band for for them. Very solid bands. A listing, another jungle going off by Purple Chain. And now Victor. Oh, interesting. Let's see what they're gonna ban. They come to shadow. Very solid bands by Purple Team. I don't know who is it. Maybe it's Calado de Trinteu. I don't know really. And a very strange band. I'm a Victor. I don't know. It's really, really. It's not good band, I think. But they got it. They started. It. They started it and they're gonna f do this. Become the first pick, uh, Tarek, the first pick for Blue Team. Support pick. Very solid pick. Stun, you got stun, heal. A little bit of burst. And a little tank ability for him. Now he comes the first two picks for the purple team. Maybe they, they are Calado at 31. I don't know. Really don't know. But we are here on XI TV. We're gonna expect to see a nice game. The first cast of, of uh, League of Legends here today. And they come to grave a heck on. Very, very strong pick for him. Graves a nice AD carry. And a good solid top too. Then he comes the jungle root here. A great jungle, you can stun, you get a little bit damage, a tank ability, he comes to a tank. And let's see what they're gonna pick next. And he comes is real. A good pick. Maybe a counter? I don't know. If you have counter for Graves, maybe not. But he got a so good burst damage. And a nice AoE ultimate global.
And he come Castopia. A good, good solo mid hero. Huge burst dam dam damage for him. And very, very strong picks from the team, purple team right, right here. And Mundo. Mm. Mundo maybe is going to juggle or support, I don't know. <laughs> if they're gonna roll this, how they're gonna put the lanes on this team. Maybe they're gonna get a, a support Mundo. No, no, here comes the smite. He's gonna be jungling. And Kennen, another solo, solo mid hero. A good solo mid against Cassiopeia. Two strong mid, mid heroes. And Gangplank as a solo top for them. More tanky, more global. Presence. They have two good ultimates for global global presence. Hello guys, I'm Hugo from Brazil, and that's the first next TV in the first next TV streaming for League of Legends. And here for the blue team we have Scanner, Chen, and Victor Bannon heroes, and for the purple team Morgana, Lee Chin, and Chaco. We are almost in the end of the picking phase and. Gonna gonna try it in almost one minute. So the count down, counting down. So yeah. what do you think? Yeah, what you what team is the strongest one? Uh the purple team is really really strong team because they have a lot of damage coming here from from Graves and Hector and Castlefia. So they're gonna get a little bit of advantage on that lane phase. Because of the damage, the tanky ability. But he comes the late game. There's three heroes on the blue team. The three last big heroes is gonna shine. Like a, I don't know. They're so strong in the late game. They have a, he was real. He's a good, good, good. AD, AD carry. Uh, he got a great support too for Tarek. That was a stun heal, a easy, easy burst damage from Israel, and now he comes the three minutes delay. Yeah, but uh, also League of Legends, this kind of games, they they have to ward and avoid the ganks, and they yeah, they, they cannot be ganked they, they in the early game. They should avoid the ganks from from the blue team because they they ha don't have like a real real good lady face uh he gonna get some trouble in the the first side the first 10 minutes of the game the early game but they have like a great jungle for for ganks they have a gear so if you do get stronger and get some ganks coming from for the, the the blue team they're gonna get advantage and they're gonna get this really really fast because if they come if they, if they this game comes to late game they're gonna shine anyway if they get the right farm and the right kills. Oh, guys, I went. Oh, so I went to send a big hug for Will, the quad quad four and quad two caster for for next TV. Hey, Will, what's up? What's up, Will? We love you, man. Just to hey, remember man. that the sixth round of MPG Live League of Legends Championship. Hmm. So we're waiting. I think the purple team is gonna be like so strong in the laning phase. I I I'm, I'm gonna have my doubts over here. This laning phase, they have so strong jungle or two. Mundo, Mundo is a nice nice peak for jungle. He gets the slow. He gets the the damage. He gets the heal. He gets the tank ability too. So it's gonna be a strange game. Let's see. I expect to see a nice game. Very, very nice game. So am I. Yay. Ah, the last pick, Lulu. 
the people are saying to talk about her. Lulu is the new hero, the champion. <laughs> uh, he comes to the latest patch, and he got a great support too. He got like the hacks, the CC control. He can do like a burst damage in the beginning of game. He's a good support too. But I don't know, Tyrigan's hero is so strong, I think. But Graves can do the soul burst damage at level 6 with the AoE ultimate. And I get it, I want to shout out to Dazio. Dazio, I love you, man. Cheers. So oh, here comes the game. Oh, a very, very nice king. No, <laughs> from Hennec, though. A very, very nice king. Ujir also have a king, but I, I will most like Hennec, though. So badass. We are almost in the game, just 5% yeah. to go. We're counting on it. Alright, you're coming to the game. So, let's see how gonna be the lanes. Might have a cannon meet. Our deer jungle. Gonna start with the head, I think. Gangplank top. And Israel and and Tariq at bottom and all the fight for the purple team is coming the for for the middle is gonna do aggressive they're gonna invade their jungle oh get it be careful maybe our early game bank yeah they're gonna invade blue Oh, we're gonna get. We're gonna see a huge fight over here. They don't know about each other. They see the first guy. And comes the first. First damage. Mundo, Mundo takes the shot. Great, the flash. First flash comes from Kenny. And they are retreating. No, but no! That's a PM flash! And he can hide! Kenny may be in trouble. I don't know. No, he's gonna be fine. And. As I said. Really, really strong, strong team come from the purple team. Really, really strong. Yeah, Kenny they almost die. Yeah. But Kenny will be okay at the middle end. And Mudo comes back to the blue. Let's see the top lane. A little bit on age of these two guys. Gangplank is gonna, gonna on fire out here. He's gonna ignite. He's gonna get the kill. He's gonna get the first blood. Whoa! Very very strange plays come for an act over here. He should be okay. I don't know. Maybe he wastes a flash on the 
Yeah, he wins the flash. Oh, this is gonna be huge for him for the game plan. He now can control the lane more easily. You have the goal advantage here 3.9k already for the team, for the blue team. Let's see the bot lane. The bot lane, how's it go? Is here have a huge, huge difference. I have like 12 CS against 9 CS creep stat. Graves don't have any time over here at the bottom, but how it comes aggression for him? He can be a really aggression with the aggressive. Yeah, seems with we're gonna people. have a lot of effect on the, the top lane. They already hitting each oh, other. Yeah. yeah, but look at the gold difference in the level and the XP difference. And he's level two now. That's a gank at the bot lane from bloating. Oh. Yeah, th they just yeah. fail. He got the he used but they used the heal or the flash. It's it's a good trade, I think. The mid lane. SP a little bit aggressive on cannon. Mundo is almost dying for the creeps. Oh, gonna be okay. Graves being aggressive on the bottom lane. Just controlling the lane. And Mundo almost dies for the creeps. They're gonna die using the flash. Oh my god, he almost died here. <laughs> for, the, for the wolves. These mistakes can cost the game. As I said, always. And here comes another bottom gank. Here comes the first turn. And Graves is gonna be locking down, but the hill comes. And the Hex comes, but no. They get the kill on Graves. And here we have 2-0 for Bloating. In a huge goal difference, almost 1.5k difference. It's a huge difference on here. Another fight at the top lane. Again. And Ekito is come, but now he comes the Ignite. And Mundo can use the Dex. No, no, he missed it. And the blood. And Ekito is too low, he heals. He have, he have killed by Gangplank and Mundo gets the kill. Nice comeback from the top, but. Yeah, Mundo just said, kill. you're not gonna kill my friend and stay alive. Yeah. Yeah, that's funny because the no action from the mid lane. We have a lot of action yeah. at the bot and the top lane, but no action at the mid lane at all. They, they have a really good good, good time farming. Cannon is winning the farm for like 15 creeps. Cassiopeia don't have a good time on the mid middle lane. Cannon is level six. He's level five, and this game is gonna show. Me their face right now. Blue team is gonna is going huge here. Yeah, and team's gonna have a gank at top. Uh, no, he just warding. He's warding too, and he comes the gank in the middle. She's gonna be careful. She got to stun fight. And he got a ultimate for for Rene. It's gonna be the death of of Cassiopeia. And he's come four four one. 2k gold of difference, 3k almost gold of difference for them. And here comes the gang top. Black face is gonna be careful. He got, he makes the axes and he got the ground burst damage. And Hanekito is gonna be he died in the tower. No, it's gonna be a mis real mistake. They they not level f level six yet. This is gonna be it caused the bag of. Uh, 
for the blue team, Cannon's the the top gold. Top, top CS two. No, is zero. Is zero is coming. The and Graves CS. the top the top gold from the purple team. The top creep stat. And that's a gank at yeah. top lane. Another gank at top lane, but they failed. And I can only use the flash. See the, the farm, how's it going? Cannon is winning the middle lane by 40, 10 creeps, almost 10 creeps, and the bottom lane, uh, he comes the middle lane gank, no, he just, oh no, he comes against Sophia, he's three, he flashed inside him, no, no, no enough, enough, enough damage to kill him. Yeah, Bolting just showing to us that it's not that easy to gank them. Yeah. Every time they get ganked and they just run away. It comes a little bit of aggression on bottom lane. Mundo is there. And his real is winning the, the CS on bottom lane. Now Cassiopeia has two Darren's ring against uh, I guess a uh, headshot for cannon. Lead standard, standard eaten, but normal items for them. Comes the top, let you see it. See score on the top lane. Gangplank have 43 creeps, and Herecton have 42. So no big difference for him, but Herecton has two death, and Gangplank has two kills. So they got their advantage here. Oh, let's see the middle gank. Mundo gets the flash X, but no, they use use he is. Some pings come up the, the dragon. Maybe they're planning to do no. They come to the middle gate, middle lane. They come to gang. <laughs> shield, yeah. shield him. But this is a huge mistake. He can't kill, kill, kill him. And now he's gonna death. Can I with the ultimate come and kill Cassiopeia? Huge mistakes coming from these guys. Yeah. The purple team. And now three, three K. 5 1 3k gold of advantage for them, so this and is gonna show in the face of the game from the blue team. And the score is 5 1 to blue team, yeah. They can't come back, they really can't. Come. And now, can it go aggressive mid? And it comes to deer, they flashes away. Multi flashes away, you're gonna be alright. Is real, is free farming, but it's gonna be a crowd. And no, but no! Mulder is gonna be in trouble! Cannon blinks, flashes on, on him, but no, he's gonna be okay, he flash out. Let's check the, the items for the AD carries. Oh! A little bit of engage on bottom lane. They're gonna be dead. Definitely loot. No, it's gonna be okay. Huge, huge damage for. Huge coming for. It's real. He's got 88 creeps. Creep score here. Not not the best farm he can get, but a real good farm. He got one assist too. And Graves is gonna sit down in mid and doing nothing. They might be a gun for cannon. Kenny is being too aggressive here. They have no wards, no vision. And now he comes the moon over there. And Oud for Sophia. Graves over there and but he can. Lulu is solemn bottom strength.
And now some aggression bottom lane from his real his real is gonna be going huge here. He got nine five creep stats here against sixty nine from Graves. But Graves have already a huge damage becomes a bath tour. A lot of things going on on the middle lane here. But no he maybe can be okay. OD is taking the blue again. No dragons in this game already. 13 minutes of the game. They might go in for the game on the middle lane. Tariq with this time. The ultimate is ready for for him. For the cannon, so no. No, not, nothing's gonna happen. Oh, they see each other, but no. Yeah. He's back. For a comeback, the purple team might be start ganking, but they do, they aren't ganking, so... They might be Falcons and protect Graves. Graves can carry this game as Ygir, but uh, as Renekton. Renekton. But Renekton is, get, is having a bad time on the top lane. Really, really bad time. He died two times already. A gangplank. Link thanks. We have a good farm. And he's diving on, on him, but no. He's gonna be alright. Oh, he used! He's not! But Henecto. And another kill from low team. And. Oh. They die on top, on bottom too, but top gangplank kills. Kills Henecto too. Henecto is 0 3. This is gonna be really bad for the team right now. Almost 4k gold difference. 7 on 1. They are going to Drago now. Mundo is there, but he can do really nothing. Just harassed him. But now he comes the Graves. Graves doing the, the Q. Using the Q for. for it. And top tower almost down. down. Maybe he's going to dump in this meter. Yeah, he will definitely go down right now. A free tower for them. And this is gonna be bad. 20, 21k gold from the blue team, 701, one tower, and 50k for the purple team. This is really, really bad. But I was wrong. In the beginning of the game, I was thinking that Divinity is going to do for the purple team. They, 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 they have Graves, Kasafia, and Renekton. Kasafia is going to be down on Mino! And he's going to be down for Kenny. Kenny solo. Solo Q. Gets the kill along. And this is going to be really bad right now. Yeah, seems we already, already have a winner here. Yeah, but they can't come back. But I don't know, maybe. Maybe so. Oh no! Ujir is coming to his mate. Now he comes to his mate for, for gangplank. And he got the stun, the flash, the blink, the ultimate. And he looks gonna be stay alive. But no! He's gonna be dead. But now he can't be dead. Of oh dear, he's gonna be down. And Graves get the kill on Cannon. We missed that. Graves did a good job killing Kenny Cannon on the middle lane while he's facing Mundo and Henegton. Henegton 0 4, he's having, he's having a bad, bad time of the game. And now he comes to the on the bottom. Lulu is very, very low. And now he comes for this turn from, from Terry. And he comes the double hill for them. And the help is coming out from the river. Okay, Sophia is gonna be there, but do they have a war? But it's gonna be di really difficult. Comes for the gang. The blue team have like one, two, three, four, 
five wards here. And now oh, he comes Lulu is going to death. And may, maybe he had death for Tarik. Tarik's gonna be in trouble. And just death for Tarik. And Cassiopeia gets his stun. But Grave is getting a bad time here. And now Cassiopeia is falling on. Oh, he's real, he's real, he's gonna be the good time. Good time. And Cassiopeia gets his stun on the. On the Udyr. He's really gonna be that for Hector, for Cassiopeia. And now he comes to Kenny. Kenny got the ultimate off. And he gets the kill on Graves. And he gets another kill on, on Cassiopeia. And this is gonna be the kill for, for Kenny. No. He lost the kill. Nice flash coming for Hector. Like, and another fight on the mid lane. Oh. Blank Banks. Gonna be trouble over here. And Greg Banks gonna be they are fighting, but they can't hang coming. And they're gonna get the help and Greg Banks stay alive. But no. Kenny can get this done. So really for really bad. Really, really bad from the purple team right now. They get like, some kills at the bottom lane, but the yep. blue team hand came back with the cannon and the ear deer. Which, let's see the the item builds for them. Tarik. The support of team really standard. Uh, Ujir is going to recurve ball here and the Uyghur's helm. And now he comes on pink from the bottom. Let's see. No. Let's see. Can I, can I have a. Uh, oh, you have a Hamadon already. Oh, he's really, really strong right now. And for Gangplank, he's gonna be the tank, tanky Gangplank here. But he's doing a quite lot of damage. Two. For the purple team, we have Graves with the BF sword and Zeal going straight for the attack speed and damage. And he's real, he's real got like the plus thirst already. And this is gonna be really bad for the purple team right now. They come some pink from the bottom. Grave is gonna be a little aggressive, but no. He comes to Deer for the help. And he comes the first turn. No, he missed this turn. He can't turn. No, he's done. And the first is first turn. And Tyreek is gonna get the first second turn. No, he's turned Lulu. And Lulu is gonna be in trouble too. But no, Lulu is gonna be Graves alive. But Lulu is come, come down. A support kill. What do you think? Do you think they have a chance already uh, in this game? Yeah, there is a huge difference for kills and golds. I don't know, but if the, if the blow yeah. keep going, no chance for Popo. No chance for Popo. Cannon's too big. Cannon is real, it's big. It's gonna be pretty, pretty bad for Purple Team in a couple of minutes. But they, they, put, they don't push towers, they have two towers. They can push Dark Storm and that's how they do it Now he comes another huge gold advantage. 7k gold advantage now. And comes the first and first here. Do it me for and now there's a first up here. So much burst damage for them. A really really nice hit made for his real. It comes the f The me tower is gonna be done. Here, Graves. Graves gonna be careful here. It might be dead if they want to, but no. Mundo is pretty low, but no, he's okay. It's a jungle. They might go from Baron, no. but they're just warding. Yeah, Terry just warding Baron. And Graves buying wards is really, really strange here. And now he's here on a face check. But no, he comes a huge burst damage for, for the bolt of the ca AD carries. And now he comes the support. And 
He might be in trouble here. He's gonna be down. No, he's not. He's gonna be okay to heal and the flash from him. And now it's going to Terry. Terry gets the first stun. And Cannon here. And the first is Kesopia and Graves going down. And UG comes and kill Lulu. And this is gonna be GG maybe for me. Yeah, I'm that's an awesome team play for blue team. The blue team is doing excellent job keeping the carry alive, chasing, ganking those guys, searching the fight because they are stronger. They're doing it right. And Ecton comes to defend the middle tower, but he might be in trouble <coughs> if he overextends a little bit. Mundo is pretty tanky right now, but he can do much. Now he comes for the damage for Israel. Israel is getting the sheen. The pings come on the blue. But no. Not not too much action action in the game right now. She's just farming the jungle and Warding. But now maybe he comes a push mid. I don't know. They they are ping viral. Maybe they are thinking they're battle, but no, they have a ward over there. They might go in for battle, yes. They see Lulu, Lulu is warding, but Lulu gonna be in trouble no. I'm just gonna appear to defend. Really, really spins going on. No oh, jeez, no too much damage coming from the entire team. And Cannon and his real get the kill and gangplank with the ultimate. And now he comes the the huge team fight coming from the blue. And gangplank get another kill, a double kill. And this is gonna be a free barrel. Yeah. Free barrel from the blue team, and this is gonna be really bad if they get this barrel. And they got the barrel, and they came after games. Graves is a little bit overstanding here, trying to steal the Baron, but he can't. He couldn't steal, and now he's gonna be the death of Graves, maybe. No, he missed the first, the Q. Can I miss the he kill? He's gonna be okay. Yeah, seems that time to chose to hand her. I don't know. They might be the first time, Renekton is gonna be in trouble. It might be going down here. Ken is too strong for them. And the face slap, big slap coming from the EG. Now sit down, bitch. I'm gonna kill you. Pa! And now he comes the tower push. The T T T T T Come on, Lulu is gonna be trouble here. He's gonna be down, going down. And they might be overextended here, but they are too strong for here. And they might surrender now. I don't know. Yeah, it's time to still hand her. They might surrender here. They can't pull the two towers so easily. They are too strong. They tried to defend here, but nothing's happened. No damage for from Graves or... And oh, but, but Tariq is gonna be in trouble, they kill Tariq, and now it comes Graves, Graves is gonna be in trouble now, he blinks away to the fountain, but no, it's real, it's doing damage to the tower, and then, I, don't, I don't care about this fight, I'm gonna go down to this tower, and Gangplank, Gangplank is gonna do huge damage, and now my kill, and oh, Gangplank is gonna be in trouble here, no, he's fine, and he's here too, and he's getting a heater. There's a, they might be stealing the blue, the buffs. They ping the red buff, the blue buff, and the dragon. They might got this free.
Yeah, now they're gonna keep pushing, pushing the mid lane. And this game gonna ain't really so. They might, they might don't don't get the chance for comeback here. If they get a good team fight, I don't know. They don't have the damage. I don't know, this is really, really showing, this game really shows the face right now. Blue team is so huge. Do you know who is blue team? The name of the team? I forgot it. Uh, is the... Blue team is the new Roosters. And the purple yeah. team is the Caldo, Caldo the Turin one. Oh. So it's gonna be the wing from the blue team here. Caldo, I don't know the name. Forgot it already. They might push in bottom. Uh, just Castle Fizz over there is gonna get the first turn. And it might be going down here. And he's the death of Castle Pia. This game is so and right now. They might can do nothing with Cassiopeia there and Cannon It's too strong, it's real, it's too strong And Agaton can, can tank Nothing, Mundo can tank some but It can do the difference and it comes the GG And the end of the game And Cannon a little bit overextended in front of it GG comes from the booty Really well played from the blue team, but a lot of mistakes come from the purple team. Victory! And this is gonna be a game. So that was one more stream from next TV. Stay tuned. And we're gonna alright. We're gonna. Broadcast another League of Legends another match from yeah, from NPG. Game. Really, really soon. So don't go away. And kisses and kiss to Sandra. Love you, girl. See you later, guys. Bye.